वेलकम टू इंजीनियरिंग ड्राइंग यूट्यूब चैनल ओके सो द नेक्स्ट प्रॉब्लम इट इज ए हॉपर तो इन साइड ऑफ ए हॉपर देर इज ए फ्लोर मिल इट हैज टू बी लाइन विद द शीट ओके सो द टॉप एंड बॉटम ऑफ द हॉपर आर रेगुलर पेंटागन्स ओके विथ ईच साइड इक्वल टू थर्टी एंड ट्वेंटी टू पॉइंट फाइव एम एम दैट मीन्स यू हैव टू कंस्ट्रक्ट टू पेंटागन्स विच विल बी कॉन्सेंट्रिक एंड हाइट ऑफ द हॉपर हियर गिवन थर्टी एम draw the shape of the sheet to which it has to be cut so as to fit into the hopper okay so you need to construct uh, two pentagons which is of dimension 30 mm and 22.5 mm okay first i'll be constructing the first pentagon of dimension 30 mm Okay, using the scale, uh, draw a line for length thirty. Okay, show the dimensions. Dimension of thirty mm. If you are uh, new to my channel, you can subscribe to channel and hit on the bell icon for the latest notifications. and share to maximum students so that they can be benefited okay here using the protractor we have to mark for an angle of 72 degree both on the other both sides okay and take the scale and draw a line of length 30 mm so okay. this side also we have to mark for an angle 72 degree now draw a line of length 30 mm passing through that 72 degree point Okay, taking compass, uh, measure the length of thirty mm and cut the arc. So cut two arcs here. We get the pentagon. Show the dimension. is dimension of 30 mm so i'll be drawing a perpendicular bisector to find out the center I'll be drawing at least uh, three perpendicular bisectors. You know how to construct a perpendicular bisector from the corner to the opposite edge, the middle point. I have to draw the perpendicular bisector here. as we know that uh, we have to construct uh, two pentagons one is of dimension 30 mm first pentagon you can see the question 30 and 22.5 two pentagons right so first pentagon it is done now the second pentagon we have to construct that is of 22.5 so we have to get exactly from the center okay so we can subtract 30 minus 22.5 me 22.5 means it is 7.5 uh from there also we can do or measuring the length the total length here it is around 42.5 so if you do exactly half it is 22 here i can do 22.5 is 7.5 m 
means 3.75 we have to subtract on either side but after marking the point we have to uh, construct a base edge of 22.5 so if you do exactly half means from the center point it is 11.25 okay 11.25 mm so from that uh, point so construct a vertical line of length 11.25 mm upward and downward both the side okay again use the protractor mark for angle mark for angle 72 degree same way as we have constructed the bigger 30 mm uh, pentagon and the same way we have to construct this uh, smaller pentagon also and dry line of length uh, 22.5 Again here also 72 degree and draw a line of length 22.5 mm okay, use the compass measure 22.5 and cut two arcs okay two concentric pentagons done now we have to project it upward to draw the front view so here front view of the hopper it is a 30 mm so first we will show the dimension for the smaller pentagon it is 22.5 mm Here you can see height of the hopper it is 30 mm okay in the same way we have to do it just have drawn a same rough sketch draw the projection line support Now we can uh, draw the projection line to draw the front view. So here front view of the hopper, we call this as hopper of uh, dimension 30 mm. Okay. Now we have to show in the front view where exactly the front view of this uh, okay inside of an hopper is yeah
okay the top horizontal line indicates the 30 mm pentagon the lower one it indicates 22.5 pentagon okay so now those slant edges what we have to do you have to draw the lines by keeping a scale there and try to connect where exactly like a chimney okay like a chimney like we have to extend uh, this slant uh, lines connecting the top pentagon and the base pentagon just projecting it and we have to get the intersection point where we get it exactly okay now we have to measure uh, its length okay join it uh, i'll get the exact intersection point here so now we have to find out uh, okay so i'll show the front view dimension it is 30 okay in the same way we have to find out uh, the slant edge length here how much we are getting it uh, we have to mention can give the naming for the 30 mm pentagon as a b c d for 22.5 pentagon a 1 b 1 c 1 d 1 okay so the top pentagon it is a b c d e right you can mention the same thing you need to be careful when you are writing the front view here okay same way you can write the notation for the bottom pentagon measure the slanted length here how much you are getting it is uh, 138 mm if you measure it it is 138 mm okay first we will draw that uh, 138 mm uh, okay slanted length because we need to draw the development of that that hopper 138 draw mention dimension it is 138 mm now take compass draw an arc here by measuring that uh, length you have to draw an arc here okay the same way for that uh, base of that hopper measure the length from the compass and draw an arc here okay now we have to we have to cut uh, the 30 mm length here so measure 30 mm from the bigger pentagon 30 mm and cutting uh, 5 arcs here In same way the another uh, arc we have cutted right for that uh, we need to measure that uh, this one 22.5 mm okay second pentagon cut the arcs ok 
okay now we have to join this cut it points okay using scale uh, you can join this uh, cut points for the top and uh, bottom pentagon okay okay you can subscribe for the channel and hit on the bell icon for the latest notifications and share to maximum students so that they can be benefited join all the points and you can see here horizontally also you need to connect same way here also can mention the naming here a b c d for 30 mm development pentagon and a1 b1 c1 d1 it is for 22.5 pentagon okay and uh, here height it is 30 mm i can mention that guys thank you all thank you for watching the video share it to maximum students so that they can be benefited thank you all